Show me the money time. It's a moment we've all been waiting for. Show me the money in one of our favorite series. But today we're kicking it up a million notches in our million dollar giveaway. We have been finding unclaimed money for GMA viewers from forgotten bank accounts, lost savings bonds, and more. And we've been doing this for more than a year now. But today, everything, because we're going to go around the country reuniting people with that lost cash. But the goal today is to reach a million bucks and put it back in their pockets. Far and away, the most ambitious show me the money ever. Our unclaimed cash guru, Elizabeth <laughs> Leamy, has been hard at work. She's scouring the country for weeks for your money. And it's time now to see if we can meet that million dollar goal. We are kicking it off in Florida at the Villages near Orlando. Good morning, Cheryl and Ken. I'm Jeff Atwater, your Chief Financial Officer for the State of Florida. We're here today with your State Senator, Alan Hayes, and your State Representative, Marlene O'Toole. And we have dollars to return to you. $79,000 that belongs to you. It's all yours. <laughs> Just like that. 79000 bucks. That is a great start. We're going to go to Lynchburg, Virginia now, where Vicki Bridgman, the state's Treasury's unclaimed property program, has a big surprise for the Lynchburg Transit Employees Benefit Associate. Show me the money. Show me the money. You ready? To I'm ready. See the ready. Dollar? I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. money that was found in that account. So that's great news for those workers. There's a lot of money. Take a look down there. Okay, the grand total is more than $164,124, and we have a few more stops sure to make. Do. Next, Atlanta, Georgia, and a special announcement from Doug McGinnity, Georgia's Commissioner of Revenue. Good morning, GMA. I'm here to deliver a check to Carol McGill and Judy Ramsey for unclaimed property that their mom lost track of in the amount of $94,810. Amazing. <laughs> Boy, mom lost track of a lot of money there. So <laughs> 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 Eighty bucks from the cable company, like that. <laughs> not ninety-four thousand dollars. So the grand total now nearly two hundred sixty thousand dollars in found money. We've got to top it though. So let's go live to Charleston, West Virginia. Good morning, GMA. I'm John Bernou, the treasurer of West Virginia, and I'm here to send a check for four hundred and eighty-one thousand three hundred and thirty-five dollars and seventy cents. <laughs> That is a big I am just excited to be here and, and thrilled to be able to give this money to the family. Thank you. Aww. Thank you very much. Mm -hmm. Oh, I know. Yeah, Nearly half a million dollars. That brings us close, much closer to our goal of a million. We're up to over 740,000. I love that sound. <laughs> Can we make it? Just one more stop. Yeah, Elizabeth Leamy is live in Arapahoe, oh. North Carolina. We got our fingers crossed with this one, Eli. Take it away. All right, I am here with North Carolina State Treasurer Janet Powell and several hundred excited students because we have not one, not two, but three unclaimed property checks that we're giving back to North Carolina schools. Woohoo! Yes. Now, do I have that right? You got that right, and we're thrilled you're here to put the money back where it belongs. Fantastic. Well, what do we have first? Well, first we have a check for the community colleges, and Cleve Cox is going to accept this check. It's $17,870.32. Great. Thank you so much. We're glad you did it. Thank you. Okay. That is good. Very good, but not good enough. We only have two checks left to make it to our goal of over a million dollars, and I'm telling you, I'm getting nervous because the numbers kept changing as we were preparing for this, and I'm not quite sure where we ended up at. Well, next we've got a check for the University System of North Carolina, and it's for $127,000, $66.55, $66 and it's okay. for Lion Gray from the University. Woo! Thank you. Couldn't come to better time. seems to be bigger than the last, but we haven't reached our goal yet, and I'm scared because we've only got one check left. But it is an exciting one because the biggest chunk of this next check is coming right here to Arapahoe Charter School. Yes. That is true. That is true. Right here where we are now. So 
You ready for this? I am. Okay, raise it up okay. for me. Hold on tight. We're going to keep the suspense going a little, even though I think it's going to kill me, and do this sort of digit by digit, okay? So here we go. 363.71. Well, we wouldn't come all this way for that, would we? Let's do another one. $9,363.71. Okay, that is enough to buy some basketballs and crayons and stuff, right? But that's, we can do better. We can do better. Here we go. $29,363.71. I got to tell you, that would normally be a fantastic total for our Show Me the Money series, but today it is not good enough. All right. Whew. There better be something good under this last flap of paper. Fingers crossed, everybody. Fingers crossed. $229,363. That is fantastic, but guess what? There is something even better. We did it. We made it to our goal. Phew, so relieved. All together today, we have put together unclaimed property and returned it to $1,114,572. Don't spend it on balloons. Now it's a party. That is fantastic. <laughs> The kids waited for. <laughs> <laughs> they were just staring at the <laughs> That is honest emotion from Eli. She's worked so hard on this. Hey, Eli, can you hear us? Elizabeth, can you hear us? How they can do this at home. Find money. Found this file money. It is so very simple. It takes about 10 minutes. You don't have to pay anybody to help you. We have got all the instructions on our website. The 12 sources of unclaimed money that are out there. Some of them that people have never heard of. So go to our website, Good America, Good America on Yahoo and check it out. And Eli, that means they're now well over a million and a half dollars over the course of this entire series. And we've gotten such an overwhelming response mm -hmm. on our website from people who are looking. So those are incredible tips. We want you all uh, to con continue to keep on looking for all that unclaimed money you may have. You know, we didn't find all that much for ourselves, but there is so much out there. And, and it is easy. And it was fun to put in. I put in my mom, my brother, you know, trying to find money all around. I'm just happy when I do the laundry and I find a fiver in the jeans. I mean, <laughs> seriously. <laughs> there is a special. Your three words.